Hello, welcome back on my YouTube channel. I have some issues with my camera. It's cold here and the batteries are dying. Okay, we are going to try to work further on this starter engine. In the earlier movie you have seen that I prepared some stuff. This one is the wrong one. So, I told you about contact servers. The electrical current has to flow from part to part. And that's the ground, so you want everything to have it clean. Why this one won't fit, I do not know, but hmm, that's not what I want. So I do not understand. Now it's connected the right way. So remember the positive power is coming to those windings. From those windings it's going to this brush. From this brush it's going to the rotor. And from the rotor it's going to ground. And ground is the housing of the starter engine. And you have to make ground to the engine itself. So, that one is finished. Not yet. We have to do a little trick. Don't use much. It's copper grease. Uh, why I use that? Because I want to keep the water outside the engine. And now you will say, moron, that's not the way to do it. No, it's correct. You need an oil ring. O-ring. Or oil seal O-ring. O-ring. And that is what I, I going to do. I put a new seal, oil O-ring seal. And then I treat it with a little bit of copper grease. Don't use much. I think this is already at too much because you don't want to have that on the rotor. I did some grease here, not much, little bit, normal ball. Even kijk zo. Yes, yes, yes. No, I'm still not ready. I have to do this one too. That's too much, yes, I know. But I'm an American. Never and never is enough. More, more, more. Bigger and better. Whatever. Also through there. I uh, make those starter motors uh, ready because I'm selling them on my site and all the starter motors I sell they have then had this treatment because I do want to sell but it has to be good now bolt or not on the upper side then we put the rotor inside with clean fingers no not one these are dirty you put the stuff together like that and still it works not then it's clean there is a little bit of grease a little bit more that's ball boring uh, grease not elbow grease whatever I know from a fact yes yeah, correct this is on the upper side and this is vertical on the engine so when I put it together I have to like of to be and this not good. This is not good. What is going wrong? Why it is going wrong? I do not know. Hmm. That's not good. I take another one. I do not know 
Oh, look, there is an oil thing in it. Oh. So I need oil. But I don't have any oil. I use. So. Let's see what happens. Maybe I make a mistake. <laughs> I think I make a mistake, but what is the mistake? I think I use too much grease. So, yeah, sure. I'm not happy. It's not going well. Because this line is not on that line, I have to do it better. <laughs> yes, I think I have to use next time a little bit of oil because pressure is preventing it. So I install new bolts. Yes, brand new. Honda doesn't sell them anymore so I found aftermarket parts but still they are very expensive. I hate it. But things are expensive. So. But when it works, it's fine. Don't pull it at once together. Please be gentle. Let's talk with the engine. Let's do it by feeling. And just what I mean to say, I fucked up the thread inside this one. is broke. But this engine will run. So. I will install later on a helicoil and first of all I'm going to check if it is works. I hate it. Oh, come here. This one is clean. This one is very fine and neat. So I can install that very easily. I use a new terminal, I think they called, call it a terminal. I will call it an electrical insulator, whatever you say, I don't care. So remember. That looks fine. So, okay, let's see what happens. I need an accu battery. This one is not a very good loaded, but let's try it out. Oh yeah, I painted it, so I have to remove some paint on the contact area to ground to make a good contact. Now, let's see what happens. Keep in mind the engine will give uh, how do I say that? It's going to rotate in your hand so keep tight on. So Yes.
I know for sure this one's going to work, but we have one problem with the thread. So I going to fix that and when it is fixed I will do another one and I take you with you with the next video. Thanks for watching. When you have questions please email me. Bye bye.